poppin' everybody? Welcome on back to a brand new episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Let's Play here on the channel. If you guys are excited for today's episode, because we're gonna go ahead and finally take on the gym leader here in Vermilion City. I am so stoked to get into this episode, and I hope that you guys are too. If you are, make sure to go ahead, leave a like for me. It is greatly appreciated. And of course, subscribe if you guys are brand new around here. So, previous episode was an episode and a half. It honestly played with my emotions so much because I've been I've been saying this so much within the games. This game honestly makes you feel so so much closer to actually be in the Pokemon world. You know, the interactions between you and Eevee, the interactions between you and the Pokemon and the characters is just so surreal. It genuinely makes you feel like you're in the game. So I, I keep bigging this game up. I absolutely love it. And you know, I'm having so much fun playing it right now. But we went ahead, we did the SSN last episode. Our team is updated, you can see it on the layout. We finally got Gyarados as well, which is really cool. Um, I'm super excited to just keep rocking out with Gyarados. Hopefully, um, if it is correct and it is Gen 1 level up, then I guess Dragon Rage is 25 as well, which is going to be really good. Um, what we can do here is we can go ahead and use the move Chop Down that we did learn in the last episode. Seems... Oh, did you hear Eevee? It seems... Oh, so you can just go up to the tree. Oh, yo, that was dope. Hey. Good work. You chopped down that troublesome tree and opened it way to the gym. And that means you can challenge the gym now and I'll be waiting for you there. Ooh, I wonder what the requirements are for him. Let's go ahead and take a look. We're in Lieutenant Serge's gym. Oh my god, look at this. Look at the electric beams and everything, dude. Oh my. That's so good. So what's the requirements, homie? I've been waiting for you, champ. Lieutenant Serge here is the electric type Pokemon gym. Fire and water to do well. Also, there's not, um, there's not any requirements. We have a red and a blue thing here. So, is this, don't tell me they've changed it to make it so much simpler. Because in the normal games, you have to find two switches. Maybe the, the red one and the blue one, they've just lit up to make it so you can actually just find them immediately. That's crazy if they have. Alright, so we have our boy Hoshikage here. Look at the level jump. That's crazy. Um, I'm actually going to go into Drake. Drake does need to learn um, to level up. Sorry. He could do with a better fire type attack, honestly. Like Fire Fang or something like that. He could just do it with a better attack. Because Ember, Ember's alright, but it's, it's kind of weak. But I think, honestly, like, I'm pretty sure Re Lieutenant Surge is going to have, like, a Raichu. But I don't know what level. I'm going to say like level 25. And if anything, we're under level now. Which is unfortunate. Because like the gym trainer's Pokemon are level 22. So that's making me think we are really under leveled. It's making me think we are really under leveled. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and put Drake up front. Because Hoshikage ain't going to be the best around here. So let's take a look. It's a blue trash can. Oh no, they just made it. Oh, okay. No. Wow, that's crazy. Oh no, Charmeleon. Okay, so we found the first switch. Nope, there's only trash here. And then it resets. Yeah. But does it stay there? Oh, it does stay there. Okay, that's cool. Oh, so the blue and red doesn't really matter. Um, Usually it's next to it. So I'm going to say, is it? Oh, yeah, there we go. Cool. So now we can take on Lieutenant Search. So that wasn't too hard. So it must be they're always there. All right, Lieutenant Surge, my boy. Ha, <laughs> Ten Hut. Welcome to Vermilion City Gym. Would you look at that? A pint-sized challenger. Ha, <laughs> you got a big and brassy nerve to take me on with your puny power. A Pokemon battle is war, and I'll show you Sibylin. Civilian, oh my lord, Sibylin? I'll shock you into surrender. What the hell is a Sibylin? Sibylin? <laughs> Here we go, we're taking on our boy Lieutenant Sergi. He's got three Pokemon. He sends out the Voltorb first. Okay, what level are these? Because I need to know if I'm underleveled or not. I really need to know if I'm underleveled. It's level 25, definitely underleveled. It's Thundershock. Oh my god, this dude is literally a powerhouse. That's gonna kill. Yeah, Thunderbolt. 
That's, oh, I'm in one health. Oh, thank you so much, Drake. You hung in, homie. I'm gonna have to let you go down now, though, because I need to quit. I need like um, a clean swap into Eevee. I'm sorry, Drake. I had to let you go down like that, my brother. Okay, Willow's coming out. Honestly, like you should, if you had a ground type Pokemon, like I've got the trio in the back, it'd be so clutch just to have that thing on our side. It's a light screen, so he's boosting Spadef. Ain't gonna save you from a headbutt though, homie. Ain't gonna save you from a headbutt. And Willow gets to level 25. Nice. And that's just the starting level of these guys' Pokemon. Oh my lord. I thought uh, it said Rage. I thought it said Dragon Rage. So yeah, it's... Uh, well, he's supposed to learn Leer. I think. Okay, Rage. Uh, you have Magnemite. No, I'll keep battling. So let me figure out... I'll figure it out while we battle this guy. Um, I'll just go for the Sizzly Slide. So, Gyarados. So it isn't Generation 6 level up. What generation of level up then is it? Or is it its own level up? Could be. Yeah, I think, guys, it's its own level up system. Oh, the Raichu's here. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's its own level up system. All right, that's not bad, then. That's not bad. Yeah, it's its own level up system. The Raichu's 26, dude. I'm just going to go for the Sizzly Slide and just burn the dude. So residual damage. Oh, my God. Thunderbolt! Oh, Eevee, you true champ. Okay, so I don't think another Sleazy Slide's gonna kill me, but he probably will heal up. Oh my god! It's so much damage! Oh no, Willow! He got the crit! Oh, he runs back, he doesn't die! Oh my no, dude! Okay, I'm gonna have to go into our boy, the trio. He's definitely gonna heal up here, which is super unfortunate, but... Let me, let me revive our little Eevee. So happy they're saying a Nuzlocke. Why did I choose a revive? Ah, uh, they've got the same thing where it should cancel it out. Oh, he didn't. He didn't. Why didn't you heal up? What? Okay, well, the trio just got a bunch of points for no reason whatsoever. You're the real deal, kid. <laughs> Look at Surge, dude. Ah! <laughs> Fine, take the Thunder Badge. There we go, Eevee. We did it! The third gym badge. That's, that's not all. You're special, kid. Take this. What? <laughs> we get Lieutenant Surge's autograph. Oh my god. Yeah, and he's like... Ah, don't worry. I'm not getting this at all I'm giving you. And we get the TM-36, which is Thunderbolt. That's dope. I could actually... Ah, uh, you see, well... I could really have learned that to, to Pikachu, but it's all good. Hey, look at that. We take down Vermilion Gem. Oh, Misty's here. What? Why is Misty here? Don't tell me you just came to see the sights. Oh, he's you again. Oh, wow. So you beat Lieutenant Surge. You must be pretty good. Glad to see you really learning a thing or two, and your Pokemon must try their best. Oh, she healed me. Thank you. Oh, me? I'm going swimming in the sea. There are times when you just want to take a break through a puny little pool uh, and swim in the big blue. Where are you heading next? Have you been to Diglett's cave? It's pretty close by. If you haven't, I can show you the way you want to guide. No. It's nice to turn down such an offer, but it's... Okay, Misty. Okay, yes. Great, then let's go. It's literally the, the same place I was walking, but... It's whatever. It's a cutscene, I guess. This is Diglett's cave. Diglett dealt with the cave on their own, so be sure to see lots of Pokemon. So now I can finally go back 
this way through Diglett's Cave because we only got to um, explore a little bit of it, didn't we? So now I can fully explore. We've already caught the, the, the Doug Trio. There's just the Diglett I need to catch. And I think obviously that's all you can find in here. No, I think you can find Geodudes, question mark. Dun, dun, dun. It's so... Dude, it's so long. Holy crap. There's no Diglett showing up. Well, I'll be damned. In Diglett's cave and no Diglett's. <laughs> oh, there you are. Hey. See, Diglett's the one that I don't have. Bop. Oh my god, what was that? That was like a little salt they threw. That was like a... Dude, like my throat? It's crazy how like shot to bits my throat is right now. I've literally been recording this since like 2 in the afternoon. Uh, my throat is just so dying out. It's so late at night here as well and I'm just like... But I want to make sure I, I'm grinding it. I want to get as much done as I can for you guys. Alright, Diglett. Add it to my party. There's another bloody Diglett. Okay, I'm not too interested in you, Diglett. I'm sorry. I want to go back because this takes us to Pewter City. And there's some items there we can pick up. Um, I'm pretty sure we can talk to Professor Oak's assistant again. I don't know why the old dude's just chilling in Diglett's cave, but... It's all good. Yeah, we're back here. So there is an item, I'm pretty sure, chilling around here. Wreck Andy. Oh, we found three Great Balls. Thank you. That's actually really clutch. Like, finding items like that now is... It's so essential to the game. Yes, he's here. Yo, remember me? I'm Professor Oak's assistant. I'm so glad I ran into you. Why don't I show you a neat trick? Actually, no, it's a little too bright out here. What? Inside? Oh, this is where you get Flash! Flash for Rock Tunnel! Makes sense. Makes a lot of sense. That's why she told you to go there. So you came, then let's get back to the, uh, let's get down to the bass tracks. I've got something good to show you. Believe it or not, I have mastered the secret technique, light up. Now let me turn off the lights, and That's nice and dark now. If you calm your heart and breathe deeply, you'll be able to sense your surroundings, no matter how dark it is. See? It seems bright, even with the lights off. My keen focus spreads those around me. You see, here I can teach you how to do it too. Oh no, Evie wants to learn it! Huh? Seems Evie wants to learn it instead, Yellow. Yeah, he already knows Chop Down. Bloody hell, mate. Oh, so that's good. So Flash is a thing. Yeah, cool. I like that. The secret technique light up. I didn't expect that. I thought it would have just been a TM. This guy's like over in the corner, the little kid. He's like, I can't see anything. Yeah, so that's why Misty was there to take you there too. Because she makes sure you need to go there. Oh, now rivals here. Who, oh, Yellow? Did you learn to use light up from the Professor Oak's assistant too? What? He didn't learn, but Willow did? The partner of yours is really amazing, Yellow. You know what? Actually, might know some place you might be able to use it. Want me to take you there? Oh, so he takes you there? What? No, I'm fine by myself. You should be alright. Oh, no, I clicked A. No, you're gonna take me. I miss out on all of. Oh no, it just takes me back to Cerulean. Oh, that's okay then. I wanted to scoop up some of the items and stuff, but... But yeah, if you go down further on from there, you can go grab some items and stuff like that. I don't think it's anything too major, but... There's some things you can get. Oh, dude, look at all the Rattatas. Man. Yeah, we, know we weren't going to be able to skip this train, no worry. Dude, we need to grind up our team! Like, we're so underleveled, it's insane. Like... Oh, she's an Eevee. I wonder... What level? 21. Yeah, we definitely need to grind up. <laughs> 100%. Oh, we get the burn with an ember. Oh, that's just residual damage. That's unfortunate. I'm pretty sure... A Charmander... Is it Adamant? I need to avoid the attack. That's annoying. No, oh, I definitely need to... I need to grind my team up, so I'm just gonna have to go about and capture loads of Pokemon, aren't I? 
Like, that's a fast way to grind up your team as well. It's literally just by capturing Pokemon over and over again. Because, like, when I was capturing uh, the uh, the Drowsies, when I was leveling up my Magikarp, I was getting, like, 150 EXP to 200 EXP a go. Uh, and sometimes in battles, you, you don't necessarily get that much back. So, I think it's it's a huge shout to do. Just keep capturing Pokemon over and over again. You know, take, take an hour off from progressing on in the game. Uh, and just capture Pokemon over and over again. Uh, and it's going to really help you out. She sends out a Gloom. Really good for us, actually. Oh, I'm just going to go for an Ember. And you avoid the attack and you go for Acid. Come on, man. That's not fair. That is not fair. Dude, I can't wait. We have a Gyarados, right? And we can ride on the Gyarados. We can actually ride on the Gyarados. That is crazy. That's why he wasn't following us, so... It's probably like Surf. I guess. When you can learn Surf... Um... That's probably when you can ride on him. But the lady did say... If... I think for next episode, you know, I'm gonna go... Like, after this part, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna capture those Meowths. Because the lady told me... If... Um, if I capture so many Meowths, she'll let me, like, on a ride Pokemon. So that's gonna be cool. And I wanna- I wanna make sure and just check that out and start off next episode there. So I think that's what we should do. Alright. One more attack and she's gone. I should know that I keep missing my Embers. There we go. Thank God. Goodbye, Gloom. Got a nice 289. See, the EXP points, it's... I, I wish you got more. I really wish you got more. I really wish you did. Because it, it feels so hard to train up the Pokemon. Alright, I need to go down here, because there were the Meowths, weren't they? I'm pretty sure I saw Meowth in here. Or was it up on Nugget Bridge? Can't quite remember. Oh, yeah, it was up on Nugget Bridge, wasn't it? Because now I, I remember. Because all I was seeing in here was Vulpix's uh, Jigglypuff there. Yeah. So let's head on up back up to Nugget Bridge. Um, I guess... No, I guess I can do that off screen. We might as well progress in the game for now. But dude, look at this! Oh, I love it. I just love it. We might as well progress on in the game, in a sense. I am so happy that you're, you you know, your EBL Pikachu can learn these moves. I am so happy. So you don't have to have, like, TM Slaves and everything like that. I'm so happy. Like, TM Slaves, like, uh, trying to get a TM Slave is the worst in your party. It really is. Oh, we have Eradicate here just chilling. What's up? What's up, man? Let's scoop up that item. Find an Ether. Uh, obviously, there's just Rattatas and stuff like that. Nothing too crazy that I want to capture. Uh, if we carry on... I think there is an item down here, but I think you gotta do a battle. Oh, Charmeleon! No, I'm sorry! Oh, yeah, he just comes straight back. Yeah, um, there's a battle that you have to do there. But I'm pretty sure it's worth it, because it's a... No, there's nothing there! Oh, dude, I thought it was, um... I thought there was a TM there or something. So, I wonder if you can find random TMs. This guy's got a Geo, dude. I wonder if you can find random TMs. Or unless you just get them from, like, either gym leaders or the coach trainers. Alright, let's go into Hajikage so my boy can just start firing out some scolds. Set some stealth rocks, okay. Skull it is. They should one-shot it easily. Yeah. So happy we got Skull. Like, Thunderbolt's such a good TM as well, but I have no one that can learn it. <laughs> it's the only unfortunate thing. I guess if I could scoop up a good Electric-type Pokemon, maybe something like Magnemite, because it's Steel-type, and it's Steel-type is such a good typing to have in Gem 1. So, I guess, I guess, yeah. 
We could we could we could like scoop up a um a magnemite. All right, go for one last scold and take care of this guy. We might actually get to the entrance of route uh, of going into rock tunnel actually. But again, this game progresses really really fast, like super fast. Like I what episode are we on? I need to check in my recordings. We're on episode. We're on episode 10. And like we're almost in Celadon City. So again, it gives you an idea, like, even because I'm even only doing 20 minute episodes, but it shows you like, you know, how quick this game progresses. It really does. Uh, another camper dude there. Um, no, I guess everybody is quite trained up. Oh no, what am I doing? Move Pokemon. There we go. I went to put my boy Hashikage up front. Hashikage! I wonder what Rock Tunnel is like. I'm so excited to get to Lavender Town. Because once I get to Lavender Town, I can see like all the ghost Pokemon and stuff like that. And like, I am so looking forward to Sylphco. I am so looking forward to it. Like, just seeing how the gyms changed and stuff like that uh, in Saffron City Gym. Because if you saw the trailer for um, Sabrina, like the background of her gym all changed. Like it was like, on, it looked like it was on the top of Saffron City. So I hope that is, uh, that's true. All right, well stay in, he's got to eradicate. Uh, he's probably just gonna click Super Fang, aren't you? Straight up. Oh, because of the quick attack, okay. Not bad, we got a burn, okay, good. God, it's so annoying. That Radicate's so bloody powerful. I went for tackle. I should have pressed by it. There we go. Okay, it goes for the crunch. Okay, good. Don't lower my spadef. Okay, you burned. And it's gonna take bite. So yeah, definitely for next episode, I think I wanna catch you those meows. Um, I'm probably just gonna have to go back at the Nugget Bridge. Scoop those meows so like catch five and then we'll see what she was on about like you know which ride Pokemon it is because I've got I've got no idea which ride Pokemon she was talking about. I really don't. We found a super potion, nice. What ride Pokemon could she be talking about? Oh dude, look at him! He looks bloody jacked up. Don't want to battle you. Oh my god, we just skipped all of that. <laughs> We're here on route 10. So, oh, we can find Nidorans here? Okay, cool. So again, Nido King could be a thing. Is the Nidoran female? Alright, nice. Team Rocky Grunt here? I'm... Well, hey, you're the kid that's been getting Elway all the time. Oh, what? Oh my god, what is happening? It's because of you that Team Rocky's reputation was totally smashed. We'll never be able to face the boss at this rate, which means we'll have to take our revenge out on you. Oh, dear God. Hold it. Who's this? Is the... Oh! Lorelli! Oh my God, no! The music! Is the... Oh, no! <laughs> Giving up on a child. I absolutely can't forgive that. Ganging up on a child, sorry. Who are you, lady? We're getting up in you and taking you on two. I'll handle these three. Can you take the other one for me? Dude, look at Lorelli! Oh my god, man! No! <laughs> Dude, Lorelli! I, I think that's how you pronounce her name. I hope it to God it is. She looks amazing! She looks amazing. Dude, she looks so good. It looks so good. Alright, Hajikage, take the scold. One more attack and this Radicate's gone. Go for the bite. 
Ah, uh, Super Fang, such an annoying move. Crazy that it, it literally just does half your damage, half your health. Alright, getting some nice EXP from that little boy. I guess Hoshikage up to level 22. Shouldn't learn Dragon Rage, to be honest. Not <laughs> Diglett's level 14. What if the boss hears about this? Dude, Lorelei, though, look at her. She's. Oh, she's out now. Jeez, kid, just how strong are you? Even three of us rushing you wasn't enough. Those incredibly powerful ice type Pokemon. Who are you? I am Lorelei of the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Shall I freeze you all, Solly, too? <laughs> Elite Four, we surrender. Yeah, you better run. Dude, she looks mean! You're a pretty talented trainer. It was plain to see you during your battle. I see, so you're collecting gym badges. Ah! I look forward to when you come to challenge the Pokemon League. Until then, see ya. Dude, what the hell, man? I was not expecting that at all. I was not expecting that. That's crazy. Oh my god, she just popped up like out of nowhere. My days, dude. <sighs> We're gonna go ahead and wrap up the episode here, guys. I am so, so ready to take on Rock Tunnel. I'm so excited because I have no idea what's gonna happen. If stuff like that's always popping off, then it's gonna be crazy. It really is. Guys, I'm so excited. I hope that you guys are too. If you are, make sure to go ahead and leave a like for me if you did enjoy the episode. And of course, subscribe if you guys are brand new. With all that being said, I will catch you guys back in the next episode. Remember to be nice to each other. Don't text and drive. I will see you guys very shortly. Thank you so much for watching. Till then, guys, take it easy. Bye!